Okay, so today's question is what is the control and cutoff value of blood pressure in hemorrhagic strokes? So basically why we want to control the blood pressure in the intracranial bleed? Because we think that if the BP remains high, there can chances of increase in the hematoma size or increase in the size of bleed in case of intracranial bleed. So there was an intra 2 trial which compared blood pressure, systolic blood pressure of 180 versus 140. They found that in both the blood pressure, the hematoma size remained the same uh, and there was no increase in the deaths, but the uh, disability score, ranking scores was better in which 140 was the target maintained. There was another trial, a test 2 trial, which compared blood pressure of systolic 110 versus 140. They found that again the uh, size remained the same, but renal complications are more in which we keep the uh, blood pressure low at 110. So blood, systolic blood pressure is somewhere around 140 and diastolic less than 100 is a reasonable target in hemorrhagic strokes. Do read more about it.